Hi, buongiorno. My name is Francesco Mazzei and I'm the chef padron of Nanima restaurant in the city of London. And today I'm going to cook for you the beautiful Welsh lamb ragu. Okay, so I have a ragu, uh, beautiful uh, lamb mint, uh, celery, carrots, onion, thyme, bay leaves, pancetta, uh, broad beans, peas, milk, lamb jus, tomato paste, and fettuccine. So I'm gonna start now. And the first thing I'm doing, I'm gonna use some amazing extra virgin olive oil, where we're gonna go and sweat the veg, okay? So this all being cut by hand, uh, just the best way really. So olive oil, thyme, bay leaf, celery, carrot, onions, pancetta now. And we sweat. Okay, lots of beautiful flavors here. As you can see, we just put a little bit of olive oil as uh, the pancetta fat will melt. When it starts to have this beautiful uh, golden color, we take the herbs out, okay? If we keep the herbs too much inside, they will give a totally bitter taste, which we don't want that. Now, we're gonna add the means and smash it a bit with the, with the vegetables and pancetta. Very simple, really. And now I'm gonna add a little bit of uh, white wine. And uh, very important, when we put the white wine, we make sure that it goes completely evaporated, yeah? So, it evaporates and in the meantime it cooks. So it doesn't take that long. Now I'm gonna add a little bit of full fat milk. Okay. A little bit of tomato paste, let's say a tablespoon, yep. We mix together and we had this beautiful lamb stock, okay. Then broad beans. And peas. Okay, so we mix it. A little bit of salt. Okay. A little bit of uh, fresh ground pepper. Black pepper, please. Nice. And we leave on the side, okay? And we cook for about half an hour, 25 minutes, okay? Depends how much is it, okay? While we cook this, what we usually do in Italy, we make pasta, but uh, we didn't make pasta for you, so you can find fettuccine anywhere in the supermarket, anywhere in, uh, in, uh, in, uh, in this country, of course, all right? And uh, so as soon as one is ready, we're gonna saute the pasta with it, with a little bit of pecorino, which is, uh, lamb cheese huh? and uh, we finish the dish I've got here some uh, water uh, of course when you cook pasta it has to be hot boiling salted water okay very very important okay I'm gonna put my fettuccine or tagliatelle inside okay and we're gonna cook for two or three minutes I'm gonna add a bit of this beautiful ragu we did Look at that beautiful spring smell here. Yeah? Broad beans, peas, the fresh lamb. Okay. So as I said, the fettuccine will take a couple of minutes to cook. Take the pasta out. We toss it, we mix with this beautiful ragu. We add a bit of uh, water where the pasta is being cooked because it's full of starch. The starch gets released from the pasta, yeah? And we cook further, one minute further here, so the pasta absorbs the flavor of the ragu as well, okay? Mm. 
if you can always smell it, it's just beautiful here. Okay, you got this, look at that. Now, pecorino cheese, and uh, I love a bit of uh, parsley here, only parsley, okay? A drop of uh, extra virgin olive oil. As you can see, there is no butter here, yeah? Only extra virgin olive oil. We mix it. Wow, that smells good. Okay, and I'm sure it tastes better than it smells. Wow, beautiful, beautiful. I mean, a nice bowl of this it can easily be your uh, starter, middle, and main. And a drop of extra virgin olive oil. Why not? A few pea shoots on top. Okay. All right. A little bit of more pecorino cheese. And uh, there we go, our beautiful fettuccine with Welsh lamb ragu. Nice.